In other news, smart greenhouses are taking another step forward. With high technology sensors and LED lights, smart greenhouses are expanding because they help grow various plants year round. And the latest development is in placing these smart greenhouses on rooftops of buildings in the city center to help with energy efficiency. Our Yunjin reports. On the rooftop of this eight-story office building in the city center of Seoul is a 150-square-meter glass greenhouse. There are roughly 100 hydroponic vegetable spots where bell peppers and eggplants are grown. The smart greenhouse precisely controls temperature, humidity, and air composition, as well as emitting light that helps plants. Another big advantage of these smart greenhouses on buildings is that they also trap heat and contribute to saving energy in the wintertime, while blackout curtains for the plants in the summer also block the heat from sunlight. Growing the plants in the city, in fact, improves photosynthesis, allowing the plants to grow better. The technology for this rooftop smart greenhouse was jointly developed by researchers from various institutes, including the Korea Institute of Machinery and Materials, universities and technological companies. And they are running the project's first demonstration to get its efficacy verified. Next year, the researchers are planning to install solar cells in the buildings that are being test run in smart greenhouses to decrease energy dependence. And in the next demonstration, the goal is to apply a technology that can circulate carbon dioxide produced from the building to the rooftop smart greenhouses and oxygen produced from the greenhouses into the building. Energy used for heating and cooling can be reduced by 20 percent, and carbon dioxide, the main contributor to climate change, is expected to be reduced by 30 percent. This latest technology is expected to prove efficient in buildings that produce a lot of heat, like data centers, or buildings that produce a lot of CO2, like gyms. Ian Jin, Arirang News.